Welcome back, Future Medicos. In the previous video, we have seen the stray vacancy round details for BLDE deemed university at Vijayapura. In this video, we will see the stray vacancy round details for KLE deemed university. There are two uh, private medical colleges that comes under this KLE deemed university. So we will see the details about uh, how to get seats in these two colleges in the stray vacancy round. Okay, so this is the admission notification against unfilled management or paid seats or unreserved seats. So you can see here, there are two colleges for which uh, the counseling will happen. One, Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College, Belagavi, in which there is only one seat available. And then the second college is KLE Jagadguru Gangadhar Mahaswami Galu Moor Savirmat Medical College or JG Triple MC Hubli. This is the second college in which there are six seats available. So if you go to this particular campus for stay vacancy round, you can participate in the counseling for the seven MBBS seats available. I'm not going to talk about the dental college because still I have not seen any notification from MCC for uh, the vacancies of dental colleges. So let's not look at this in this video. We will just focus on the MBBS seats. So there are seven seats available for which uh, the college will conduct the stray vacancy round. When the counseling is going to happen, the counseling is going to happen on 7th April 2022. Okay, this is the date on which the counseling will happen at KLE deemed university. Please take note that every college will have different dates or sometimes many colleges will have the same date. For example, the last two colleges we have seen, BLDE deemed university, the counseling is happening on 8th April, whereas KLE deemed university, the counseling is happening on 7th April. Say, for example, if you want to go to KLE first, you can try it on 7th April. And in case if you don't get a seat, then you can quickly go to BLDE deemed university and then try to get a seat there, right? You have to try your luck because we do not know which college you will be able to get a seat. It all depends on how many candidates turn up for counseling on that particular date. Now, when you should be present at the college, you should be present at the college at at least 10.30 a.m. on 7th April because the registration is starting at 10.30 a.m. and the registration closes at 11.30 a.m. So in case if you reach the college after 11.30 a.m., then you will not be considered for counseling, okay? Then counseling, when it starts, it starts at 12 noon. That means uh, once the registration completes uh, between 10.30 to 11.30, who can do the registration? Only candidates whose name appears in the eligible list given by MCC. And those candidates who come to the college on that particular day, the candidates can do the registration and um, the college will prepare the rank list based on the need score of the candidates. And they will be calling one candidate after candidate based on the rank of the candidates who are present at the college on that particular day. So there are seven seats available. So they will keep on calling rank one, rank two, rank three, rank four. And if the first seven candidates are showing interest, they will take the seat and then they have to pay the fees immediately, right? Okay, where is the counseling happening? The counseling is going to happen for both these colleges, that is Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College, uh, Belagavi, as well as KLE, uh, K J Triple MC, right? JG Triple MC, Hubli. Both colleges, the counseling is happening at KLE Academy, JNMC campus. So you need to go to Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College campus, Nehru Nagar, Belagavi, okay? So even for the college, Hubli College, the counseling is happening at Belagavi. Please take note that, as I told you in, even in the previous video, the physical presence of the candidate is mandatory. If you are not present at the time of counseling, you are not eligible for getting a seat. This is not an online counseling. This is not a counseling conducted by MCC. This is conducted by the colleges themselves, and you need to be physically present there. This is a spot counseling, okay? 
and please take note that you should carry all your original documents if you go without original documents you are not eligible for counseling and you also need to bring the prescribed fees in terms of either demand draft or online counseling okay rpgs neft also you can pay so either you can take a demand draft or you can pay online at the college after getting a seat allotment now let us look at what is the fee structure for these colleges now the fee structure you can see here um, for uh, KLE Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College Belagavi, it is 18.25 lakhs per year. Uh, so as you can see here, the first year is 18.3 lakhs. Uh, this fees is what you need to pay at the time of admission. And subsequently every year, the second year, third year and fourth year, it is 18.25 lakhs. And the last year, 9 lakh 15,000. Okay, this is the fee structure for KLE Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College Belagavi. Now, how about uh, JG Triple MC College? Uh, it is slightly cheaper. The first year fees is 14.4 lakhs and subsequently from second year to fourth year, you'll be paying 14.35 lakhs. And then the final year, you will be paying 7.2 lakhs. So this is the fee structure for uh, KLE JG Triple MC College. Now, uh, hostel fees for, uh, once again, uh, Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College, uh, the hostel fees. Uh, ladies hostel, um, the first year fees is 87,200 rupees. Uh, however, every year you will be paying 74,000 rupees per year. Okay. Uh, for gents hostel, it is 96,200 in the first year and subsequent years you will be paying 80,000 per year. Right. So room rent includes uh, food charges, breakfast, lunch, evening snacks, and dinner. So uh, that makes it clear that you, you are also going to get the uh, food for the same fees. It includes the hostel rent plus uh, the mess fees. Then um, the JG Triple MC, the hostel fees um, is 1,38,200. Uh, which is the fees for the first year, uh, if you, uh, ladies hostel, and even in boys hostel, the fees is the same. However, every year you'll be paying 1,8,000 from the second year onwards, you'll be paying that. And of course, it also includes the food charges, uh, which includes breakfast, lunch, evening snacks and dinner. Okay, so that's it. Um, that's the details available for you as far as KLE deemed university is concerned. So if you are interested in the seven vacant seats, please go to the college on 7th April without fail. Okay, thank you. Bye bye.